What's up, guys? Edgy here bringing another video, and today we are back in TD Presents Fantasy Draft CFM. We are in week number nine. So, um, you guys are probably wondering why was there no week eight game? Our opponent wasn't available, he didn't respond. Um, so, we got a force win. Also, if you guys watched the last episode, you guys know we got a force win against the Saints guy because he rage quit. He tried to say that he went to get food, but we know the truth, guys. I'm just going to say it. I think I'm starting to strike fear into the rest of the league. Seems like the last couple weeks, people don't want to play me anymore. And like I said, this is a casual CFM. I'm not even, you know, really trying my hardest. I'm not running my money plays all game. I normally run the, like the first drive of the first half and the first drive of the second half is when I use like my normal scheme. And the rest of the time, normally I'm running coach suggestions unless it's, you know, it's a close game and I need, you know, a big first down or something like that. But for the most part, we're running coach suggestions. It's a very casual CFM. Um, but at the same time, we're flooding pretty much everyone we play. This week, we do have a team that um, the owner of the team basically dropped out of the league. We had like four or five people quit out of the league, and we only have a couple replacements. So for now, there is unfilled team. So I actually play with CPU this week. I am going to show you guys that gameplay. Probably just highlights. It's not going to be a, you know as intense as a normal game. My energy might not be quite the same. But since we did have those two force win games... They did um, kind of tank went stats. So I was averaging about 300 yards a game, and now he's 12th in passing yards. He's averaging 243 yards a game, 23 touchdowns, 6 interceptions. So I was probably the clear-cut MVP, but since we had two force win games, his stats went down significantly. He still had a decent amount of touchdowns. Uh, he only threw one pick in the two games, but dropped his completion percentage massively. He was at like 73 or 74%. And dropped his yards per game down significantly as well. I was around 300 yards a game. Uh, but we got a CPU this week. So, you know, maybe we stat pad a little bit. Try to get him back up there. We do want to win MVP with them to prove a point. Um, but, yeah, I'll go over real quick the team they're playing against, even though it's a CPU. All right, guys. So the Chiefs have Stephon Diggs, Josh Jacobs, Allen Robinson, Tyron Smith, Kevin Byard. And then there's a big drop off in their overall. So they got some really, really crazy firepower offensively with their top, top four players. Um, and then after that, it's pretty much a big drop off. They got one really good player on defense. The rest of their defense is average. The rest of their offense is average. So should be easy win. It's a CPU. Um, I'm not even sure if the difficulty is on all pro or all Madden. But either way, we're going to come out of here with a dub. I'm going to do these upgrades real quick, and we'll hop into the game. We got a ton of these upgrades. Also, um, off camera last week, since our opponent didn't play, we got an upgrade for Tarverius Moore. He actually got plus one speed. So that's one of our guys that we use there sometimes. So that's huge. I think he's up to 94 speed now, maybe 95. Uh, but we got upgrades for a lot of players right here. I'll go over the, you know, the big ones like Andrew Whitworth here. You know, the high overall players that are actually starters. I'll show you guys the other ones. I'll just auto upgrade. So we got plus one pass block finesse, plus two to pass block power. Very nice. That's the main thing we need him to do is pass block. Darnell Savage. The young stud safety, upgrade his zone up to an 82 overall. Can he get a speed boost too? No, plus three tackle, plus one pursuit, plus one play rec, plus one awareness. Sometimes I don't understand these upgrades. It says zone, you know, upgrade, but then he doesn't get anything for coverage. I mean, I'm not upset about upgrades, but it's just something that I thought about. Okay, Giovanni Bernard, who had a crazy touchdown run in the game that our opponent rage quit. Uh, they're running back number two, plus one carry, plus one juke, plus one spin move, plus one break tackle. Very, very nice. Andy Isabella, one of our sleepers on our team. Absolute stud. Crazy fast. Up to 77 overall. Let's see what he's get. Okay, plus two medium, plus two short route running, plus one awareness. Very, very nice. Davin Gotchow, a guy that doesn't seem to feel often, but we'll throw the upgrade on him anyways. Up to 75 overall, plus one block shed. Uh, we'll upgrade Justin Houston and the rest. We'll just kind of auto upgrade. Justin Houston, he's played pretty well. He hasn't had any crazy performances, but he's been good. Um, plus one speed on an old man and plus one power move. We'll take it. I'm going to auto upgrade these ones, guys. And we'll go ahead and hop into this game. And uh, let's go try to go crazy with Carson Wentz. Here we go. Using Tarverius more. Plus one speed to him, like I said, guys. Let's go. Big sack. Justin Houston got an upgrade, and he came to play. Here we go. Come on, send the spy. Let's go. Get him short. Let's go. Good stop, defense. All right, guys. Tyreek Hill. This is a returnable punt. See what we can do with it. Not much to run, but we'll take it. Starting at the 30. All right, here we go, guys. Coming out in this strong close. See if we can take a shot early. No, we'll feed that to Kenny Drake, though. Let's go. Gain of five. Here we go. 
Devontae Parker. Let's go. Here we go, guys. This is cover two. We're going to throw it to Tyreek Hill. It's not cover two. Johnny Smith. That levels concept. Almost into the end zone. Down at the two. All right, guys. First time in shotgun this drive. See if we can get Andy Isabella a touchdown. Try this jet sweep out. I might just cut it in as soon as I get it. We'll see. Get in there. Andy Isabella in for the touchdown. Let's go. Let's right, spread the D-line out. Take that. Knock that out. What? How did he get the ball there? All right, guys. We put Demario Davis in to be the spy instead of Justin Houston. Trubisky's pretty fast, so we want somebody who can keep up with him. Short. No first down. Held to a field goal attempt, guys. 56 yards. We put a returner back there. Tyreek Hill. Oh, he didn't let me return it. All right, guys. We're running some coach suggestions now. Let's see what we can do here. Kenyon Drake on this angle route. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on, use that speed, Kenyon Drake. Use that speed, Kenyon Drake. Big game, baby. There we go, guys. Dot. Devontae Parker. Diving catch on a slant. That's a touchdown. Beautiful throw by Wentz. Up by 14. Let's go, Vaughn Miller. Good sack, baby. Field goal is up. They're on the board with three. Let's get back on offense, boys. All right, guys. Running coach suggestions once again. Let's see what we can do here. Dot. Andy Isabella. Let's go. No huddle. Here we go. Tyreek's got pressed man on the outside, it looks like. Dot. Get that catch. Inbounds. All right, guys. We're going to motion Parker over here. This is a coach suggestion. This is a play that I like to run. These two crossers. Normally one of them gets open. Let's see if we can make it happen here. Isabella. Oh, no. My button's disappeared. Come on, Wentz. Take off. Get out of bounds. Get out of bounds. Let's go. Save our timeouts. All right, guys. Third and ten. Coach suggestions were not working out for us this drive. So we're running one of our plays that we like. Let's see if we can get Tyreek out in space. Yes, sir. Rack catch that. Timeout. Let's go. Here we go, guys. Andy Isabella, rack catch that into the end zone. Beautiful throw by Wentz. That's another touchdown. All right, guys. On offense to start the second half. Let's keep adding on to this lead. Speed Kenyon Drake. Decent run. Gain of six. Here we go. Dot. Tyreek Hill, get your feet in. Let's go. Beautiful throw. Beautiful catch. Moving the ball. All right, guys. We just need some good blocks here. Should be able to do something with this. Let's go. Can you Drake? Can you Drake? What a spin move. Come on, use that speed, baby. Use that speed. Big run. All right, guys. We just got sacked on back-to-back -back plays. We haven't been sacked much this season. We're going to block an extra guy, and hopefully we can get this ball in the end zone. Devontae Parker. Get that yard after the catch. Yard after the catch. Into the end zone. Another touchdown for Devontae Parker. Let's go. Let's go. And Dominican Sue. Here we go, guys. Eric Harris, there's a pick, boys. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Running back. Pick six. Let's go. Here we go, guys. Let's go. Fletcher Cox with a sack. All right, guys, start of the fourth quarter, up 35-3. to three. Got to play some more defense. Pick that. Shaquille Griffin. Shaquille Griffin. Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys. Let's give Kenyon Drake another carry. He hasn't got too many this game. Let's see what he can do with it. Cut it in. Oh, that was a nasty cutback. That was a nasty cutback. All right, guys, we're going to run this. I'm going to put Johnny on a drag here. Leave the other two routes the same. Oh, Wentz, come on, man. You always make those throws. All right, guys. A rare missed throw by Wentz on the last play. Would have been a touchdown to Tyreek. But we're going to keep it rolling here. Andy Isabella. Andy Isabella, what a throw. What a catch. Way to make up for it, Wentz. Up 42-3. to Got to watch the fake, guys. It's fourth and two. Nope, they're punting it. 
Tyreek Hill. You got plenty of room, buddy. Do something with it. All right, guys. Very minimal punt return by Tyreek Hill. But we don't mind. More room for the offense to work. Let's go, Kenny and Drake. Good run. Almost the first down. All right, guys. Third and one here. My dump is off to Giovanni Bernard. We'll see. Nope. Devontae Parker. Cut that up. First down. Let's go. We're going to go for it here, guys. We got to get this. Oh, no. Under pressure. Incomplete pass. Back on defense, guys. Let's go, guys. Oh, what a throw. What a catch. Touchdown by the opposing team. Here we go, guys. Give Kenyon Drake a screen. Get Wentz some passing yards. Get Kenyon Drake some touches. There we go. We got a lot of room in front of us. Let's go. Let's go, Kenyon Drake. Please, come on. All the way. All the way. All the way. That's a long touchdown. 77 yards. Kenyon Drake off the screen. Let's go. All right, guys. See if we can get one more stop and get one more touchdown on the board offensively. Like I said, we got to get Wentz some stats this game. Pick that. Eric Harris. Go down. Go down. Let's go. Here we go, guys. Andy Isabella. Andy Isabella. Get juked. Into the end zone. Andy Isabella once again. What is that? His third touchdown? Maybe fourth? Great game by Andy Isabella. Let's go. All right, guys. We're not going to have time for another offensive play. So let's just see if we can get you know another pick. Maybe a sack. Something. Let's get our guys some extra XP. Pick that. Darnell Savage. Oh, Hardy. Great pick. Let's go, guys. All right, guys. So let's go over the stats. We won 56 to 10. Obviously, it was a CPU. So, you know, we're not going to be too excited about that. But uh, let's go over to our stats. 17 for 24, 402 yards, 7 touchdowns, 70 completion percentage, no picks. Uh, longest pass was 77 yards on the screen to Kenyon Drake. Kenyon Drake, 6 carries, 50 yards. Carson Wentz, one carry for eight yards, but like I said, uh, Kenyon Drake had that big 77-yard catch. Andy Isabella, seven catches, 124 yards, four touchdowns. Devontae Parker, four catches, 91 yards, two touchdowns. And Kenyon Drake, much help with that screen, three catches, 125 yards, and a touchdown. Tyree Kill had a you know minimal game again, two catches, 36 yards. Um, he had a couple that would have been touchdowns that Wentz had some bad throws. Johnny Smith, one catch for 26 yards. Defensively, uh, let's see. We had three tackles for loss, one by Keon Cross and Von Miller, Fletcher Cox. We had one and a half sacks by Von Miller, one by Sue and Houston, and then half a sack from Fletcher Cox. We had two picks by Eric Harris, one by Hardy, and one by Shaquille Griffin. Um, kicking, we didn't take any field goals. Overall, guys, very good game. Hopefully, you know, get Carson Wentz back into that top um, MVP status. But I'm going to go ahead, see if we got any upgrades, and we'll wrap up the episode. All right, guys, so we got two upgrades, two starters. Jerome Baker, I do not know why they didn't do a face scan on him, but he's going to be up to a 79 after this upgrade. Big-time player on our team, obviously. Our favorite user, uh, plus one strength, plus one tackle, plus one block shed, plus one awareness, plus one excel. I wish he would have gotten the speed, but excel is helpful. Damian Lewis, the rookie right guard, started at like a 71, I believe, and he's all the way up to a 77. Lead block, plus three pass block plow. Ugh. <clears throat> plus one lead block, plus three pass block power, plus one run block. Very, very nice. And guys, I'm going to just go over the standings and stuff like that real quick so you guys get a you know a feeling of how we're looking. Um, we are 9-0. Second best team in our division is 3-4. and four, So we're sitting pretty, we pretty much already clinched the playoffs. Um, let's go over the stats. So Carson Wentz, um, not everyone's played their games yet. So he's first in passing touchdowns, second in passer rating. Um, and I think it said third in passing yards, fourth in passing yards, uh, 2,353 yards, 30 touchdowns, six interceptions, uh, up to 261 yards per game. He's been sacked seven times. Um, very, very nice season. Rushing, Kenyon Drake is averaging 69.9 yards a game, 5.4 yards a carry. Um, so he's on pace for 1,000 yards as well. Receiving, Devontae Parker's leading in yards. Andy Isabel is leading in touchdowns. Um, Tyree Kill still having a decent year, but he's pretty much the number three option at this point. Johnny Smith, he has he had a one big game. Other than that, he's pretty much you know one or two catches a game. Normally they're clutch catches though, so I won't be upset about it. Kenyon Drake, 233 yards and a touchdown. You know we spread the ball out like I said. Defensively, Jerome Baker leading in tackles, not surprised. Sacks, 
Von Miller is up to 10.5 sacks. Fletcher Cox is at 5.5. Interceptions. Eric Harris, Jamel Dean both have 4. Tarverius Moore, Darnell Savage with 3. Keon Crossan, Shaquille Griffin with 2. Jerome Baker, Demario Davis, Justin Hardy all have 1. Tackles for loss. Fletcher Cox with 10. Jerome Baker with 6. Defense has been playing lights out pretty much every week, guys. I think a lot of the forced fumbles aren't recorded, but it says we got 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Um, I feel like we've gotten more than that, but I, I mean... It could be accurate, and it says we've only gotten one fumble recovery, which I feel like we've gotten more than that as well. But yeah, guys, that's going to wrap up the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are excited. Hopefully next week we have an actual opponent. But if you guys did, please make sure to smack that like button, hit that sub button if you're new, turn notifications on. As always, everyone have a great day. I'm out.